50 times the universe decided to troll one person specifically and it resulted in these funny pics. Funny pics, people. What, what, what else do you want? <laughs> a voice crack? Cause there, you got that too. <laughs> oh, Louisiana police officer crashes after Owl flies into patrol car and starts pecking at him. Owl from Louisiana. And I'll do it again. Oh my gosh, on Boxing Day too. This happened on December 26th. First of all, shout out to all my Canadians who celebrate Boxing Day. My whole life, I had no idea that Boxing Day was a Canada thing. Like, look, look at this. The day after Christmas, right? Boxing Day is a holiday celebrated the day after Christmas day occurring on the second day of Christmas time. What? Christmas time? Though it originated as a holiday to give gifts to the poor, today Boxing Day is primarily known as a shopping holiday. Give gifts to the poor? They never told me that. They never told me that. Observed by the Commonwealth nations. That's Canada and Britain and them. So yeah, when I moved to the States, people don't know what Boxing Day is. Boxing Day is, it makes no sense. It makes absolutely no sense. You just bought all your stuff for Christmas. You're supposed to like save money for the day after Christmas to go shopping makes absolutely no sense. It's horrible. Also, what a crazy tangent to go on from an owl picture. Only at Robert IDK. <laughs> I will be late for work today. There's a cat on my car roof. Have to take the bus. You can't just take the cat off the- Oh, oh, I know where this is going. You can't just come in late because you don't want to bother a cat. Just get rid of it. I'm afraid I won't be able to. What's more important, your job or the cat? This is the cat. This is the cat. <laughs> Is this real? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I'm buying this one. This is too perfect. A cat? Why would you say a cat? Why not say a 20 ton industrial vehicle? A little bit more impactful than saying you have a cat on your roof. People are just crazy, some, crazy sometimes, you know? Live every day like your 2001 Nicole Kidman leaving her lawyer's office after divorcing Tom Cruise. Tom Cruise. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I am calling, I am calling nonsense on that one. <laughs> Guys, I'm officially calling nonsense. Where's our, our nonsense uh, cue? Nonsense. I don't think Tom Cruise has, there's no way Tom Cruise has Twitter. Tom Cruise Twitter. Well, by golly, he does. <laughs> Maybe that's real. Is that real? Oh, this could be real. Well, Tom, you didn't deserve, maybe you deserved it. I have no idea what you're like behind closed doors, Tom. Never mind. People, we're only gonna look at half of these today. If you want to watch the other half, 10,000 likes, people. You guys have been incredible at hitting like goals recently, so I'm sure you can do it. 10,000 likes, people, do the second half. Okay. Thousands of people plan to attend a barbecue in front of the home of a vegan Australian woman who took her neighbors to court after the smell of meat cooking in their own backyard. Oh my gosh. I think we have a new contender for the Petty Olympics. This is the pettiest thing. Both things, everyone's petty here. A person trying to take someone to court over smelling meat cooking. That's petty and just unbelievably stupid. Thousands of people having a meat cook off in response. That's petty. That is petty on a nuclear scale. That is nuclear level petty. I can't. These people, oh my goodness. This is what happens when you turn 70 and you still have a sense of humor, but you have nothing else to do with it. Oh my gosh. You can't. can't we all just love one another, you know? Vegans and meat eaters. Just live in harmony, you know what I'm saying? I actually did have one person send me a message once that was like, you talk about uh, good things for the environment, doing the right thing. You never preach about a vegan diet. Bruh. Cause I'm not gonna tell people what to eat, dude. I'm not gonna tell people what to eat in my videos. So please leave with that. <laughs> Nonsense. If I won Powerball, I'd buy every ticket to a Kanye West show, and when he came out, it would just be me, like, you suck. Well, that's, why? Why? Then Kanye doesn't even have to perform. Hey, thanks. Buy every ticket to a Kanye show. Okay, he doesn't have to perform now. Thank you for the free, like, half a million dollars or whatever you just gave Kanye. Wow, I'm sure he's really gonna, I'm sure he's gonna really stay up late at night crying himself to sleep, wiping the tears away with your $500,000 check, my dude. Good job. How could you make a store, blah, blah, blah? It's in my code. It's in my code. Have y'all ever seen record? 
Wreck-It Ralph? Yeah. <laughs> Remember? No, Kanye. That's not what we're talking about here. We're not talking about Wreck-It Ralph. But have y'all ever seen Wreck-It Ralph? Oh, gosh, guys. I think that's... <laughs> I, we, we've got a new uh, running joke on the channel. I don't know where they come from, but they just happen. Robert and K videos are what we call a stream of consciousness. I don't know if you know what a stream of consciousness is, but it's what Robert Eddie K videos are. We don't plan them. We don't plan them. We hit record with a general idea of what we're doing and we end up where we end up. And it's, a, it's that simple. Imagine getting arrested and a cat just comes along and sits on you. Aww. That would make it better. That would be better. Not that I'm wishing for a comfy pavement for criminals to lay on, but having a kitty on you would make it better. I like a kitty to lay on me a lot of the time, honestly. I don't have a kitty. I don't want to do the whole feeding and all that thing. You know what, let's get Nobu. Hello, mister. We were looking at a picture of a cat sitting on someone and that leads me to grabbing you. Wasn't really necessary, but hey, buddy. This candle company makes sense inspired by places. This is his Ohio candle. Ohio, not much to see, not much to do. Welcome to Ohio, the unscented candle. Wow, that was poetic. Hey, Nobu, you wanna turn around, bro? You wanna turn around, bud? He's bog- oh my gosh, Nobu loves it up here. I have so many friends from Ohio, I will send this to them. Because nothing is more fun than giving anti-Ohio memes to Ohioans. What are you- oh thank- oh you like the Ohio jokes, don't you buddy? Okay. Oh. My. Gosh. Kids playing with a water- <laughs> look at this picture! Look at this picture! I don't need to read the caption at all! Kids playing with a water hose during Coast Guard demonstration. That's what headshot. No, boo, can you not? Can you not dig your foot into me, boss? A boss, a boss. No, boo, boss. Hey, boss. <laughs> now, there's no way that, the, that he got pushed by the face out to the water by the hose. There's no way that's the way this went down, but it looks like it, and that's what counts. Johnny created the group Barbecue. Barbecue to borrow at my place. Nice. Can't wait for a fat steak and a pair of ribs. Great. Eddie Vegan's here? Yeah, me. Glad you asked. Sarah has been removed from the group. <laughs> bye bye, Sarah. That wasn't the universe ganging up on anyone. I mean, yeah, don't invite the vegan to the barbecue. It's just literally that simple. That's that simple. For $5, this shelter will write the names of people you hate in the litter box. <laughs> That's kind of hilarious. That's kind of hilarious. $10 for a last name as well? Because if so, what's your email? <laughs> I'm just kidding. You know, you know, I wouldn't do that. Hey, Nobes, can you turn around, bro? Bro, turn around, buddy. Okay. Okay, now there you go. Hello, hello. I got you. He hates the camera. You hate the camera, eh, Nobes? Okay, now you face the people. There we go. Gotcha. Gotcha. <laughs> now you have to say hi to the people. Say hi to the people, Nobu. Did he, did he catch that? Okay, we're putting you back, bro. <laughs> what is the worst state you've seen a public bathroom in? New Jersey. No, that's not what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. But why are you asking people for the worst state they've seen a public bathroom in? Is this how you get your sick kicks? Kind of weird, bro. Kind of weird. All right, we might have to censor this one. Come on, universe. Why you gotta? Why you gotta give us the bird like that? I don't appreciate that, universe. Come on, get out of here with that. In the Lucifer series, Lucifer is shown to be the only angel to have a British accent. This is because after ruling Heck for a millennia, he picked up the accent of the most common people found in Heck: British people. What? Now that's just not nice. That's just not nice. I, hey, I, I lived in jolly England for half a year. And I don't like the disrespect towards British people. And that's why when I do a British accent, it's the most respectful, non-cartoonish British accent in the world. Okay? I never disrespect British people on this channel. All right, well, life doesn't get much worse than this. <laughs> Oh, where are you? The ground is eating your car alive. You weren't meant to have a driver's license.
license. Car sinks into the into the ground in Mumbai, India, amid heavy monsoon. Okay, okay, he heavy monsoon. Don't take out the kya, okay? Don't take out the kya. Imagine doing military type training for ten years just for this to happen. Okay, what a horrible. Oh, jeez, that's that's cringe. That's cringe right there. I don't want to see it, honestly. Ugh. As a UFC watcher, eye pokes are just the bane of my existence. I hate to see them. They are extremely cringy, and I don't support this. I don't support this uh, at all. Thank you. Walter Summerford was struck by lightning in 1918. Six years afterward, in 1924, he was again struck by lightning. Another six years later, in 1930, he was struck by lightning again. Even after his death in 1932, lightning struck his grave in 1936. Wow. This man is lightning in a bottle, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Looks like you've been... Thunderstruck! <laughs> All right, that's not appropriate. That's not appropriate. Come on. Listen, actually, would you want to be the most thunderstruck person of all time? Kind of an honor. Kind of an honor. You're basically Zeus. You were probably this person was probably Zeus in another life. Bos <laughs> Bosnians. I want to swim. Croatia. No. <laughs> Yo, what the heck, Croatia? You just jacked their entire coast? Come on. That's as petty. That's just petty, Croatia. I don't know what kind- Hey, whatever- whatever problems you guys have, I want you to sort it out right now. Bosnians need to swim to Croatia. You can't just hog up all- No, I know- I don't care who started it. I don't care who started- Well, then fix it. Fix it. Everyone deserves to swim in the Adriatic Sea. Yeah, everyone deserves that. Sort it out, Croatia. Come on. Come on. Let's be adults here. Guys, the history of marathons is kind of whack. A guy in ancient Greece died after running 26 miles miles, and what do we do to honor him? We run 26 miles, and not die? People decided to just flex on him for the rest of eternity? If anyone pulls something like that on me, it's instant hands. Okay, oh my gosh. This is probably the most Twitter tweet I have ever seen. That's kind of funny. Is that true? What? According to legend, a messenger named, I can't mess this up, he's a legend. Fidipidis. Nailed it. Ran 40 kilometers or roughly 25 miles from the town of Marathon to Athens. Oh! To announce a Greek military victory. <laughs> then promptly dropped dead. For the first time, Olympic marathoners ran a distance of blah, 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 blah. Okay, okay. History mystery. Okay, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. Something went wrong. Reason. Healthy living isn't available <laughs> in your country. You in the States. <laughs> Nah, 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 Okay, healthy living is probably like a training program. They probably call the training program healthy living. Again, poor choice of words. Is this a bad choice of words, people? Here's yesterday's video. Did you, did you see it? Did you see it? Did you not see it? I don't know. If you don't want to watch that one, you can watch this one. I'll see you here. I'll see you there. Love you guys. Peace out. Peace.